Howdy folks, it is Lanso90 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Cataclysm Dark Days Ahead. So, I've switched back to my old microphone. I don't know what I'm going to do about the, the new one. Like, it's a better microphone, you can tell. It's like way heavier, way bigger, it's newer, a lot more expensive. And, uh, I just can't figure out how to make it sound as good as I got this one to sound. So, we're just back to the old one, and I think it's for the better, probably. As sad as that is. Anyway, let's get back to playing here. I did notice you can click to move now. I don't know if I want to do that. Seems kind of uh, pretty risky in some situations. That's what we've got. Oh, uh, let's see. I remember we got beat up on a little bit there. We're not infected or anything. It's been... A week or two since I played last, so. I'm trying to recall what all we were doing. I think we were moving into this building. I can't remember why we were moving into this one, though. Oh, because... I think it was because it has windows. This one doesn't. Like, we can't live inside of this... Oh, it doesn't have the wood stove, that's right. And we couldn't move the wood stove. Okay. Now I'm starting to remember. It's possible, though, I could level up to the point of being able to build the fireplace. It only takes one survival. The problem is we need a digging tool. And, I'm pretty sure we already did this, we don't have anything with the quality digging that we can make. Because the mods aren't installed anymore. Actually, let me pause the recording. Let's see if we can't figure out how to get uh, the survival tools mod going again. Alright, so I have turned the mods on. It does say in like the world options that they're working and stuff. But it's not showing up in my um, crafting menu that I can build anything. So, I don't know what exactly that is. It probably just has to be on when you start the game, otherwise you don't know the recipes. So hopefully, if like we level up a survival skill or something, then we'll get access to it. In fact, we may as well let's try to search these uh, plants. Although I don't know if any of these are the searchable ones. Just does it automatically now. I don't have to pick the direction, it seems. This isn't a great forest to work with, though. There's not a lot of these right next to each other. Oh, something fell out of this one. Oh. I'm hoping if we can get a survival point or two here, that some of that stuff will unlock. And the same deal with uh, fabrication and all that stuff. A plastic sheet. It's a lot of withered plants from one plant there. We do have to read some of these newspaper pages here in a bit. Wild vegetables already, too. This rivals up. I don't know if that means we have any. There's the digging stick. Now, this might be just in the default game, though, so I don't know for sure yet. The only way we're going to know for sure is to find. Makeshift shovel. We might need. Yeah, that's the thing, is I don't know if uh, the digging stick is part of the default game or if it's part of the survival tools mod. It might just be part of the default game. Unfortunately, we need a shovel in order to make the stuff that we really need to make, you know? Like the fireplace and all that good stuff. We need a level 2 digging tool. That's 
that's all right. Be able to get two levels of uh, survival without too much issue. And then we'll just try to level up our uh, manufacturing ability. A lot of wild vegetables. Like, the last time we tried leveling up our skills, we weren't finding any uh, wild vegetables at all. Didn't must have increased the spawn chance, or just something was not right back then. Wild herbs. I got all sorts of stuff here. It's all gonna go bad, fortunately. That's alright. Let's grab all this. Most of them done in this field, I think. Get these last few here, and we'll see where we're at. The second level usually takes a fair bit to get done, though, so... Would not surprise me if we aren't too far into it. Alright, what do we got? 35. It is all right. And these are all refrigerators, right? Yeah. Now just put them all in here. Back into the forest proper. We do have to be careful though, because we led some zombies into that forest. They could come back out of the woodwork to mess with us. There's a bunch right here I didn't get. What was that? Bee bomb. Huh. Even though that was a thing. Alright. I don't know if picking the lilies gives us anything, but... May as well give it a shot. All sorts of different plants now. Though I don't remember if like the trees and stuff... Uh, I mean something fell out of this tree and I can't grab the, st the stuff that fell. Paper page. A spurge flower. Plant something here. I guess let's go ahead and plant plant there. Doesn't really matter to me much. We got fifty. Getting there. Box. Have to worry about this FEMA camp though. It's like it's pretty nearby, and it's pretty risky. Oh, 
Hopefully I don't need any of this stuff, because <laughs> it's all gonna go bad here. Generally speaking, though, it's never really been that important to me. Wild vegetables and stuff. I think they used to be a little bit more important. Like, I think you needed them to, uh... Oh, you needed them. Wow, that's a lot of the tourist scenes. You need it for, like, broth, I think. And then broth was needed for, like, everything that you could make. As far as food goes. process. Will not deny that. Once we're level 2, though, I won't take in any further than that, because won't be any use for it. That doesn't really pay any attention. That was a poppy flower. I think that used to hurt you if you just picked those without thinking about it. Didn't seem to do anything that time, though, so maybe they don't work the way they used to. Like, I thought they, like, attacked you in the past. Like, they're, like, living... Living enemies, pretty much. You mess with them. This is really bad. It should be going up. Or, well, I guess it's 12 12 right now. A lot of feathers, actually. That'll be useful. Making arrows. Okay, there's the camp. That's not a FEMA camp, it's the freaking rest area. <laughs> I don't know why that rest area is so, like, out of control. Never quite seen anything like it. Just an empty can. For some reason I was thinking it'd be a, a full can. That'd be pretty nice, but no such luck this time. Okay. After we finish off some more of this in the field, I think we'll go to the forests that are like way down south, so I don't have to worry about aggroing zombies from the rest station. Because we are not ready to fight like that yet. We actually got pretty beat up just from regular zombies. I think they made the regular zombies stronger. That and or they nerfed our starting equipment or... Just being a little bit weaker is causing us some issues. Let's double check to see if these even help. We're at 83. It does help. They're very slow, but... Might as well. Might as well get rocks and stuff while we're out here. Room. 
Sorry, plants. Chicory might be a little bit more useful than some of the stuff that we're holding onto right now. But I'm not really that worried. This flower has a heady aroma. Interesting, you can dig that one up by the roots. Oh my fuck, boys, rakins! Rakins! That's one of them furry little friggers are. Dead human out here doesn't have anything on it. Not a big fan of those spawns. <laughs> it used to be any time you found a body out here, they'd have good stuff on them. But those days seem behind us. Decorative plant seeds. Well, again, right, let's get into the forest proper. We'll have a little bit more. Should level up a little bit more quickly, I think. carry anymore. I see how much stuff we're wasting trying to do this, but it's alright. The map is pretty much infinite, so if we have to go further out to get more stuff, then we can just do that. Those are actually tempting enough to throw something down for here. For the cardboard box. How are we doing now? So close. <laughs> 99%. Survival skill is increased to two. Digging tool. There it is. Stone shovel. All right. So I wasn't crazy. It is there. So possibly you didn't even have to level up to um, to know that it exists. It's possible, or. I don't know. I feel like normally when I look it up at the start of the game, it's there. I just can't craft it. Either way, leveling up fixed the issue, so it's good enough for me. Let's head back home. So now we don't necessarily have to live in the other building. We may still want to. Just because it has uh, windows and stuff. Could craft out in this uh, stall room here, though, if we wanted to. Uh, let's see. Are these made of wall? Yeah, or met <laughs> made of wall? They're made of metal. I'm thinking, well, it'd be nice if we could like knock one of these out and put a a window in. But it's not really in the cards for us. The only thing we'd really be able to do is we'd have to set up some sort of vehicle to generate light for us. But I think we have to live in this shack. It's okay. It's just not very interesting. <laughs> so. Let's see y'all listen to here. Drop all this extra stuff in the back. Let's 
see, it's wheeled our... Why does the fanny pack have <laughs> stats for how to use it compared to everything else? I guess it's because you can... It's a little bit more whippable than other stuff, but... Okay, I guess I don't... I'm not carrying anything. I thought I was wielding something so that the mattress... So I need to drop it to pick up the mattress, but nope, that was all right. All right, there's a buttload of stuff here. Take several trips. We'll just carry it piece by piece, part by part, though. Rather than trying to move it tile by tile. Yeah, we can just dump everything when we're carrying it like this. Make use of the hotkeys when we can. The blankets last just because they're so big. There's like no reason that this wood shack like isn't good enough, you know? It's just, uh... Oh, I thought it'd be cool to live in the metal building for once because we haven't really done that before. And it would be like for sure safe. The other thing is too, really, though. Drive of Masic software. How did I miss that all these times? Maybe I did notice it before and just. Oh, I thought. I don't remember bringing that up. I was thinking maybe I just left it there because I figured we'd just live in that building so it wouldn't matter. But okay. Welcome home, such as it is. We're all out of time for this video, though. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, remember the like button, keep the conversation going in the comments, and subscribe if you want to see more. Until next time, I hope you have a good day.